able, Gennady's, Gennady was able to stand his ground, and now we're here finally getting the rematch with Canelo. Um, with all the drama that went down, with all the, uh, well, well, I guess I was telling Gennady, he likes drama show, but not this kind of drama. What kind of fight are you expecting come fight night? Well, it wasn't because of the negotiations. I think it's because of the cancellation, because of the VADA testing, because of things that have been said from team to team, from uh, uh, Canelo uh, talking to me like he did at the press conference. All those things add up, and I think that because of that, there's going to be a little animosity in between them, and I think that it, it may make for a, a more explosive fight. You mentioned a little bit of bad blood. Um, can we expect, or do you think that Canelo will stand in the middle and fight more? Because I know you were critical of him moving around in the, more than we expected on the first fight. No, I don't expect to, expect him to stand still, uh, stand in the middle. What I expect him to do is attack Golovkin, not not uh, not uh, punch out of uh, react reaction, not punch in defensive manner. Uh, try to knock out Golovkin, like you said you were, because when that happens, and that means that they're both at range, that means that whomever's a better boxer, whomever's a better puncher, whomever's smarter, is going to land the shot that they land. But if one guy is just throwing punches out of desperation and running, it's difficult for the other guy to attack. So I don't expect them to stand still, no. But I expect them to fight a little harder or a little longer and not in spurts so that he can knock out this guy. Over.